Hey everyone, this is Justine from Just Plans. If you are new here, I post decorative and functional spreads on this channel. And if you're not new here, welcome back to another video. Today I have a memory plan with me using a print petticoat bandit kit called Winter Fours. And this one is super special because Connie of Coco Plants and I helped Katie, who is the owner of Print Petticoat Bandit, um, design the full boxes and pick the artwork and all that so really really exciting these are the stickers from the printable kit that i printed out um and yeah i love printable kits because they are inexpensive and i already have a silhouette and sticker paper so i might as well use them and yeah this was really really exciting so super generous and thoughtful for katie to um, include Connie and I in her design process. It was so much fun. We were able to, like I said, pick out the clip art, help her design the full boxes, and um, also design like the faux foil color that she, or not design, but like help choose. <laughs> Honestly, Katie did all of the hard work. <laughs> she just was kind enough to allow Connie and I into her process and like help her make some decisions. So it was really, really super fun. Um, Connie and I twin kitted this week or uh, not exactly the same week, but we twin kitted using this kit together and so if you are interested in Connie's spreads please feel free to check her out on Instagram. Her handle is at coco.plans and I will link that down below in the description bar. So I chose to uh, pair this kit with silver foil. I think that was kind of a no-brainer. <laughs> I think it could have also uh, looked really nicely with rose gold but I thought I would just stick with the soft um, feeling of this spread and just go with silver. It's been a while since I've done um, silver with a winter kit which is super super odd. I think I've just been on this kick of like wanting to contrast my foils with the kit <laughs> um, but this week I just decided to like let's just go all in with the winter and go with silver. So I pulled in a lot of these lace trim dividers that I'm putting down also um, as headers and I use them in the sidebar too. Connie uses these all the time so I thought it would be fitting to use them for this week and I do really like them. I just don't pull them in as much as I wish I did. So those are from Honey Inked if I didn't mention that already. That swirl that I put on that full box in the sidebar is also from Honey Inked. And then that little frame box is from Sweet Bella XOXO. So yeah, that is all for the base, I guess. Let's get into the daily plans. On Monday, just had to work all day. So I pulled in, I marked work the same way every single day using a scallop circle from the kit. And it does look a little miscut. That is totally my bad, or more specifically, my silhouette's bad. It has nothing to do with the printable kit. It's just my silhouette likes to do that sometimes. Um, so I used that scalp circle from the kit and then a laptop from Crafts by Towie. And then throughout the spread, I used that Sweet Bella XOXO frame box to mark anything that's like home related. So on Monday, we did have to follow up with the lender, you know, how that goes. Um, on Tuesday, the funny thing, um, this actually happened... There were two instances this day where I lost my key and my boyfriend, like didn't have his key also. So we're both temporarily locked out of our building at different times, which is like so coincidental, but like ridiculous. Um, so I actually lost my key or I accidentally dropped it when I was walking the dog in the morning. So when I came back to the apartment, I could not get in. <laughs> Thankfully, I did have my phone. So I was able to call my boyfriend to let me in. And then later on in the day, he had brought his key, but he didn't realize that his key fob was not on his keychain. <laughs> um, and he didn't bring his phone, but um, yeah, he didn't bring his phone, which like caused some issues there. Um, and he wasn't able to get in the building either. So it was kind of like really ridiculous that we had both like 
we had both experienced these issues with our keys while walking the dog on the same day. So <laughs> pretty funny. Um, let's see. <laughs> So yeah, that key that I use to mark that is from Lilac Luna Plans. I do have a coupon code for that shop. It is Justine15. All of my coupon codes will be linked in the description as always. On Wednesday, I'm marking in a very, very pretty way that I had to send out the earnest money deposit to our attorney for our escrow account. And that was not fun. <laughs> That was not fun, like, mentally. Like, just just writing a check for a large amount of money is just so weird mentally when you, like, I personally have just gotten so used to saving everything that, yes, <laughs> writing a check for thousands of dollars is just no bueno to me. <laughs> it's not the good stuff. Um, I painted my nails. This day, I used a nail polish icon from Planning World. I love Planning World's icons. They're definitely some of my favorites. And I also made some minestrone soup and garlic bread this night using, uh, I marked a, that with the Cross by Towie. I think that's like a, one of the icons in her meal prep sheet, I think. Um, my boyfriend did go to visit his parents this night. So I just used a car icon from Sadie's Stickers. And then let's see, on Thursday, this was fun. We had our home inspection. So I'm just marking down now that I just took a half day from work because um, so that we can go to the home inspection. And I feel like the, my, so the home inspection was totally fine, like nothing unexpected. Um, but I think my favorite part about the home inspection was just being in our new home for like an extended period of time. Obviously we had gone to tour the place, um, you know, which we were there for, you know, half an hour, 45 minutes or so for the tour, but for the home inspection that lasted like two hours, I think. So it was just like, it's just a different feeling being in the place that you'll be that you're in the process of buying for an extended period of time and I was able to like you know look around try to like start to envision you know our lives there so it was that was like just a fun fun time for me and then at the end of the night on Thursday this was when um everyone on Instagram was doing these assumptions so like basically you just um you put out um a question on Instagram asking for any assumptions and then um, whatever assumptions you get, you can go through and say like true or false and then add some context to it. And I thought that was really, really fun. I feel like, um, I really enjoyed it because it helped or it allowed me to talk about things that I normally like don't have, um, like a, an avenue or a forum or like a prompt to talk about, especially like, you know, doing plan with me is, it's, you know, I'm mostly talking about my plans unless I'm doing a Q&A. So it kind of felt like a Q&A on Instagram and that like was a lot of fun. And I feel like you get to know people a bit better that way as well. So I really, really enjoyed that. Um, on Friday, I was starting to feel pretty sick. Um, I don't know. I feel like this happens to me a lot more recently is that I just like start feel sick like I, I feel I have headaches I have dizziness and nausea and that happens like I don't know at least two times a month I guess or like almost every week and I really don't know what that's all about but I think it's like related to migraines I'm really not sure but I this weekend I did not feel good because of that and um yeah so I marked that with a prescription bottle from White Deer Stationery one great thing that we did on Saturday was we went to get boba twice that day, like once in like, I don't know, the early afternoon and then once late at, late, later at night. So I really enjoyed that. We also had um, training for Archie, which I just pulled in a square box from the kit and a collar sticker from White Deer Stationery. That floral foiled sticker is from Ruby J Designs that I used to layer on top of that. So yeah. Oh, oh my man. This was also the Sunday that the snowstorm that came through the Northeast started. And I honestly did not realize how much snow we were going to get. We literally got two feet of snow um, from Sunday into Tuesday. 
and that was no fun. But yeah, I marked that using that swoosh from Honey Inked and just a square box from the kit. I think Archie did enjoy it though because we did go, like when it first started snowing and it was pretty light, we did go to play fetch in the snow, which I think he really, really enjoyed. At night, I made an enchilada casserole, which literally is the same as my enchilada recipe, except that instead of like rolling them into individual enchiladas, I just put them in a casserole. Like I basically make it lasagna style because it's way easier for me to do that than to individually roll them because, you know, I'm lazy as fuck. <laughs> but I used a um, meal prep icon from Crafts by Cowie to mark that. And yeah, at the end of the night, I just still wasn't feeling too good, so I just took a long nap. And that's basically my week. I really, 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 really love how this spread turned out. I think it's so soft, so pretty, so feminine. I love that I used those honey inked lace dividers, and I also love the silver with this. It's just so pretty. It's just, I love it. I really like how this turned out. So yeah, if you are interested in printable kits and you like um, or you'd like to try them, please go and check out Print Petticoat Bandit. She is definitely my favorite printable shop. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you're interested in this type of content, please consider subscribing and I will see you in the next one. Bye.